Cable and wireless communications celebrating two years of acquiring the majority share of the Bahamas Telecommunications Company and marking the two-year point of BTC's privatization. Chief Executive Tony Rice noted that BTC is a better provider of communication services than it was two years ago, as there was only the BlackBerry smartphone, no high-speed mobile data, and long-distance charges for customers calling between the islands. Now he boasts BTC has one rate for the nation on mobile phones, 13 flagship BTC stores and a new franchise partner with plans to open up another 20 to 30 franchises. The cable and wireless chief also pointed out that the installation of the 2 and 4G mobile networks and the next generation fiber network allows mobile data and the latest smartphone availability to customers nationwide. Mr. Rice believes BTC has reshaped the business, rebuilding it to a point where the company can pay a significant dividend to the government. He admitted that the growth even further, BTC will introduce an even higher speed LTE network experience later this year, keeping the Bahamas in touch with the best available in the Caribbean and North American region. Listing BTC's significant community investments in the past two years, which has pegged in the millions, Mr. Rice also announced that besides investing more than $100 million in capital projects, the company plans to create more new opportunities for Bahamians.